Hi everyone, and welcome today to my second Naruto episode. Before we begin, as always, thank you to the patrons on Patreon. If you want to join us on Patreon, the link is in the description. Go check it out for early access to our footage and exclusive content like filler episodes and movies that are only on Patreon. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe to this channel. Also subscribe to the ton of other channels that we have, especially if you're a Dragon Ball Z fan. Go check out that anime reactions page, which is in the link in the description. Last but not least, check out our merchandise. Like this video, comment down below. And with all that being said, let's get started with episode two for Naruto. So the name I like the chanting is the village hidden in the leaves. I like that. Or the leaf village. Sure to take your picture like that. Just do it. Come on already. Come on. Come on. He's trying to get a photo taken of himself? Say cheese. That's cool. <laughs> he took his photo like school photo. <laughs> it's always the class clown. Take it again. He doesn't like it. I can't accept this photo. Yeah, well, I'm not doing it again. This is the freaking Hokage that he's talking to. He's so stubborn. Transform! <laughs> <laughs> he just had a massive nosebleed. Did you see how much blood shot out of his nose? <laughs> That's the sexy jutsu, you say? <laughs> Very tricky. <laughs> much too tricky. Don't do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this picture. You can't even tell who it is. <sighs> well, fine. How am I supposed to know all this complicated stuff anyway? What's this? Uh, oh, man! I challenge you! What? I'm going to defeat you and become the fifth Hokage! <laughs> what is that? <laughs> <laughs> He's crying. <laughs> My grandson, another his grandson? He said old man like he wanted to kill him. It's that kid. They know him. Alright, you're the one who tripped me, aren't you? You tripped over your own feet. Don't worry, pay you. Nice. <laughs> right now, he's the honorable grandson of the honorable third Hokage. Why was he trying to kill his grandpa? Ha. Now that he knows who I am, he won't dare lay a finger on him. He's just a privileged kid. I thought you were gonna hit me, tough guy. You will. I'm afraid because the third Hokage is my grandfather. I don't care if he's your grandmother. Oh, <laughs> yes, you give him that. <laughs> he's the first one who hit him. That's good. <laughs> Look at this guy. His grandpa's like, thank gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. You are the honorable grandson of the honorable third Hokage. You can have the riff raff like this draw you into a fight, even though he deserves it. Who is this guy? Due to my great skill, I can take you quickly and easily to the top, but you must always stay close to me. You understand me? Right, honorable grandson? He's gone. This kid is mischievous too. I think he followed Naruto, but I have no idea where they're going. He's with Naruto? That's a disaster! Honorable grandson! And this guy's supposed to be in charge. And that guy thinks so highly of himself, but he's a fool. That was his 20th sneak attack today. He's trying to kill his grandpa? If he starts running around with Naruto, he's sure to get even worse. Naruto wouldn't teach him anything really bad, would he? Would he know anything really bad? Just know how to turn himself into a naked woman. <laughs> the sexy jutsu? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. What's that sack of potatoes? I like how Naruto sees him with his eyes closed. I know. <laughs> I like all their sandals they wear. Uh, I know that you're following me, so it's the wrong way. Up. Rumors about you are true. You're good. All right. I'll be your apprentice and you'll be my trainer. No way. And afterward, you've got to show me how to do that sexy jutsu thing you did on Grandpa Hokage. <laughs> I need a new trainer. Please, boss. Huh? Boss? <laughs> How can I refuse? I don't know what's going on, but this is so cute. Naruto has a friend now. Yeah, his first friend. You gotta learn to control your Catra. Your Catra? Your cat? <laughs> I wanted to know the same thing. I uh, think you're talking about Chakra. There we go, Chakra. Don't yeah. question me. Real ninjas say Catra. Really? I didn't know that. That's cool. You just made that up. He believes anything I say. <laughs> He's gullible. Listen. 
I'll explain what chakra is. Chakra is the elemental life energy that is used to perform jutsu. Huh? Special hand signs allow the ninja to focus this combined energy for advanced jutsu. Dude, off! You were just reading that whole thing. I thought he was reciting it too. That's hilarious. Does it make sense to you, Madison? Yeah, of course. But it really comes down to one thing. What is it? Just plain hard work and guts. That's two things, but I'll be <laughs> I love this relationship already. There. Yeah, right. You can transform into her. Transform! Well, do I look like her? <laughs> 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 He's scared. Uh, you did it. Why am I the one that gets whacked around? Poor Naruto. Oh, he's gonna get a lot of hate because no one will punish that kid. Research on female beauty. Female beauty, right, boss? What? <laughs> they sneaked into like a magazine shop. Uh oh, this is time to get. He's a great influence on this kid. <laughs> This is the last stop, so give it a <laughs> Yeah, that's in black eye. Oh, man. Naruto's good at it. Oh, my gosh. He went in the girl's locker room? This little punk. Do they only whack me? <laughs> <laughs> Now the trick is to get all the curves in the right places. You ready? I'm ready, boss! Transform! Technically, it was right. I mean, yeah. But why does he always make the lady with the same face? This kid's too young, man. <laughs> the grandson saw um, his grandpa fall over with Naruto's jutsu. That's why he was so inspired. I know. Yeah. And the blood that gushed out of his nose. So this... Uh, Ninja? Ninja said it's something important. He's a Jonin, which is the highest level of ninja. He, he kind of seems like a fool, though. He is a little foolish from what we've seen so far. What's up with this obsession you've got with your grandfather? My grandfather named me Konohamaru. Mm -hmm. After the ancient name of the village. But no one called me that name. Not one person in the whole village. That's sad. That's the reason I've got to become a Hokage now so people know who I am. Who's that sound like? Have to become a Hokage now? Sounds like Naruto. Yeah. He keeps saying Hokage, Hokage. To really be a Hokage, you know what you'll have to do? What? What is it? You're gonna have to defeat me in battle! Oh, he's like, I'm going for the title too. It's on. No longer friends. What do you think of the village? Does it look cool? Yeah, I really want to see more of it. But he's still beaming because he became a Ganin, a ninja trainee. He <laughs> thinks that'll change things. That people will stop looking down on him now. I fear his dream may not come true. People don't change that easily. Huh? Before he sacrificed himself to save us, he asked that when Naruto grew up, he should be regarded as a hero. Oh. A hero. The fourth Hokage defeated the fox by sealing its spirit in a newborn baby. Many think the beast could take over Naruto's body. Some think he is the beast now. But he's a hero. When the people reject someone's very existence and then look at that person, their eyes become cold. Man, that's deep, wasn't it? Yeah, I feel like a lot of people are going to want him dead. Honorable grandson, time to go home. No way! I'm learning how to beat my grandfather so I can get the title. You don't even know one jutsu. Show him. Transform! <laughs> He did it. Like my jutsu. He did it. <laughs> Look at his face. Naruto's turning you into a delinquent. Only my special training can put you on the fast track to becoming a Hokage. Just leave me alone. I love how stubborn this kid is. He's gonna save him, but the only other one he knows. Naruto's so lucky that he got to learn this with the scroll in I the know, first but episode. This is the only one he knows. I'm not impressed. I'm a Jonin, an elite ninja warrior. Watch how a real <gasps> Game on. It's cool that the Hokage gets to watch everything from the crystal ball. I ball. love it. He just watches TV all day on his crystal crystal ball. What's going on? <laughs> Live TV. The news. I want to see what he has. He knows it's his weakness. <laughs> it is his weakness. 
Oh, that is a nosebleed. <laughs> you literally defeated him. With my harem jutsu. Harem jutsu. <laughs> It worked on your best. <laughs> oh man. He's young, but he knows what it's like to be a man. <laughs> I want to be Hokage so bad, but I keep messing up. You have to prove yourself so everyone believes in you. I've been ignored, pushed away, mm -hmm. and treated like I had the plague or something. And after all that, I found one person who believes in me. Oh. So you better make sure that you're ready for lots of sweat and tears. That was so beautiful. Ha! Who do you think you are anyway, giving me a big lecture like that? I'm not going to be your apprentice anymore. He's trying to defeat Naruto now, huh? We're rivals. <laughs> Konohamaru and Naruto are now rivals. Because apparently. they both want to be Hogages? I accept your challenge, and someday we'll fight for the title of Lord Hokage. Nice. Shake on it, boys. So let's both look forward to that day. Oh, he called him by his name for the first time. See ya. Nice. He's finally started down the path to becoming a true ninja. This is all he ever wanted. Because he does see Naruto as a hero. What'd you think of the second episode? I thought it was so cool to see that friendship blossom, but also to see him be kind of like an older brother to Konohamaru. And I also enjoyed his little techniques that he used on the master ninja because it worked. He's on just the... playing around. It's really fun to see that. On Konohamaru's sensei, basically. Yeah. yeah. I loved his speech about how one person believed in him and it's changed everything for him. Because we really did see that in the last episode. And even the Hokage seems to have a strong belief that Naruto was a hero while everybody else sees him as like he has the plague so i think that some great people are actually on naruto's side yeah we got iruka who is mm -hmm. his sensei yes and the hokage is always overseeing and mm -hmm. he will punish people for talking about the event that took place 12 exactly. years ago so they do have his back and it's hard to explain it to the masses who just don't understand the situation an important thing to note out with this episode was that hokage that we're seeing now mm -hmm. is the third hokage and the fourth hokage was the one who sacrificed his life to seal the beast inside of naruto so there can be multiple hokages at a time it's not disclosed yet but that's what we learned in this episode okay so those four faces on the mountain are all four hokages correct so what happened to the other two we have to keep watching okay because he keeps looking fondly at the fourth one and i think he's looking fondly upon him for all that he sacrificed for their village guys thank you so much for tuning in we'll see you in the next exciting episode peace out bye